What's going on YouTube? BTIC back again bringing a brand new video and today is my episode 1 of my Leaf Green Nuzlocke. So for those who don't know what a Nuzlocke is, it's I get to play through the game, but there's three rules I have to apply by. Rule number one, I can only uh, capture one Pokemon on each route and then if it faints or runs away, that's it. I can't get another encounter up from that route. Rule number two, for every Pokemon that I capture, I have to give a nickname to build a relationship and make the game more interesting. And rule number three, for every Pokemon that dies, I can't use it for the rest of the game. I have to put it into the PC and put it in a death box. Come on, skip through all this again. Okay, so now we're back in the main screen. So let's get straight into it. So those are the three simple rules. And I think I have to start a new one. There we are, Professor Oak. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. But first, tell me a little, about, a little bit about yourself. Wow, sorry, I'm sick. So, my voice is a little choppy and my nose is really stuffy. So, obviously I'm a boy. That's my name. And ever since I was a kid, I always thought it was always caps. I didn't even know about the lowercase, so... I'm gonna stick with what I know. And for my name, I'll do all caps. Right, so your name is Brandon. Yes, it is. This is my grandson, he's been your rival since you both were babies. <clears throat> what's his hit what's his name now? Uh what can we name what can we name? Uh S H E L D I'm gonna name him Sheldon. Don't know why. Oops, that's not it. I just feel like it. That's right, I remember now, his name is Sheldon. Very own Pokemon Legend is about to unfold. World of Dreams and Adventures with Pokemon await. So let's go. Here we are in the bedroom. So let's go to the computer real fast. So there is a potion in here. We get a free potion. Oh, I forgot to do the speed up text, but that's okay. I think I can change it. Can I change it right here? Uh, oh, it's already on fast. Okay. Right, I'll always leave home someday. It's set on TV. Oh yes, Professor Rose next door is looking for you. Yeah, 10 years old, all kids leave home, right? Okay, I don't know. Is this what it talks about next door? No, I doubt it. However. Hi Brandon, my brother Sheldon is out at Grandpa's lab. Okay, so we are going to the lab. Whoops. What? It's only Brandon? Gramps isn't around? Oh right, you gotta go to the grass first and then he tells you, oh no, you can't go out in the grass and then he brings you to the lab and all that good stuff. Hey wait, don't go out! It's unsafe, wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for your protection. I know, here, come with me. Okay, here we go. Grams, I'm fed up with waiting. Sheldon, let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here, Brandon. There are three Pokemon here. Haha, <laughs> the Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer, but now, in my old age, I have only these three left. You can have one. Go on, choose. 
Hey Gramps, no fear, what about me? Be patient, Sheldon. You can have one too. So that's not the one I wanted. That's definitely not the one I wanted. I wanted you. So I'm going with Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur is kind of like the runt of the litter. But with it being leaf green and I don't use Bulbasaur too often, I'm going to go with him. So I got Bulbasaur. And I do want to give him a nickname. So I already have my nickname picked out for those who have watched all the Pokemon movies. In the very first Pokemon movie when Ash, Brock, and Misty go to the island with all the other trainers to battle, and I don't remember their names, but Ash, the girl, and the guy, they battle uh, Mewtwo with the clones, and the guy's Venusaur was called Brute Root, so that's what I'm going to name my Bulbasaur. Okay, so this I'll do lower things. Uh, is it B-R-U-T-E-R-O-O-T? I believe that's it, but I'm going to look it up just in case. I'm pretty sure I'm correct. Uh, let's see. blah, blah, blah. Root Root is on Venus. Okay, so I was right. B R U T E R O O. Who the hell's T? T. So there we have it. I got Brute Root. He's gonna get Charmander. That's okay. You can take him. I next, I actually never used Charmander. Out of my whole life, I don't think I've ever used Charmander. Charmander was never a choice of mine. Wait, Brandon, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Now, I don't know, does Bulbasaur get Scratch for his first attack? Scratch and Growl, maybe? I don't think it starts with a um, Grass type move. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I get Tackle. Uh, let's start with Jack. I'll see what he does. Charmander really gets scratched. Okay. I'm not sure what Squirtle gets. I feel like Squirtle also gets scratched, but I could be wrong. As long as I don't miss, I'll easily do it. Okay. That's out of the way. We go to level 6. Everything's all. Awesome and dandy. So this is a special, a special attacking for the most part. If you win, you earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Battle other trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Thanks, Professor Rope. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Brandon Gramps, smile you later. I wonder if we get to use his... Uh... I wanna go to the Pokemon League. So we don't get... Okay, that's fine. Wait, I don't know if I'm supposed to talk to him first. I'll, I'll do that real quick. The brain raise your young Pokemon by making a battle. It has to battle for it to grow. Okay. I didn't know if we had to talk to him to go get some special mail or something for him. So let's go up here. So like I said, first encounters. Uh, these actually don't count until you get Pokeballs. So just so you guys know that. So what do I encounter here? Rattata. Oh, so he already does. Okay, cool. So 
Sorry about that. Okay. So let's defeat him real quick. Got it, that's so. And you're dead. So, almost level 7 already. What do you got? Hi, I work at Pokemon Mart. It's part of a convenient chain selling all sorts of items. Please visit that Viridian City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. So, another free potion. So, we have two potions so far. I really hope that we can get a Pidgey on this first row because. I don't really want a rat tail. I don't think I can fight you. See these ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You get back to Pallet Town quicker that one. You got it. So now we're in Viridian City. Um, I'll go to the Pokemon first. Hey, you came from Pallet Town? Sure did. You know Professor Oak, right? His old his order came in. Can I get you to take it back to him? Okay, so I gotta go back all the way to Pallet Town. <sighs> I'm probably just gonna use a speed up button at this point. Alright, don't feel like waiting. There's the Pidgey I wanted. Come on, so I can just get the level 7 already. There we go, level 7. And learn Leech Seed, so that's awesome. Oh, Brandon, how is my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to be growing more attached to you. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? Of course I do. Of course I do. Ah, it's a custom Pokeball. I had it on order. Thank you. Gramps! Little fly baby. I almost forgot. What did you call me for? Oh, yeah, we got a Pokedex. Alright, I have a request for you two. On the desk here is my invention, the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Brandon, show them take these with you. Thanks, man. You can get detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You must catch them to obtain complete data. So here's some tools for catching wild Pokemon. And there are our five Pokeballs. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work, however. A healthy Pokemon can in can escape. You have to be lucky. Make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't get the job done. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking of Pokemon history. Alright, Grant. Leave it all to me. Brandon, I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. I know. I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I tell her not to lend you one, Brandon. Don't bother coming around to my place after this. Well, that doesn't just say, hey, come to my house. Like, he just said, like, three times not to go to his house. But I'm gonna go talk to his sister if he likes it or not. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Gee, that's lazy of him. Here, this will help you. Give me that town map, girl. Okay, so, so far we've counted a Pidgeo, uh, Pidgeo, a Pidgey, and a Rattata. So, which one am I going to run into first? Please don't be Rattata. Okay, good. It's a Pidgey. I could maybe catch it right off the chain here. I'll try one. If not, I'll... Use tackle. Okay, so 
so that's not gonna work. Oh, that's not what I want. Actually, I'll use Leap to get a little bit of health. Oh wait, what, what am I thinking? I'm thinking of something else. Okay, I'm actually gonna die. So I'm actually gonna use one of the potions. Oops. Get my health back. Now a tackle should not kill it. Okay, cool. And then leaf seed's gonna make it go down a little bit more. Now I should be able to catch it. Okay, sweet. We got it. We got a Pidgey. Now what to name it? What to name it? Common sight in forests and woods. It flaps its wings at ground level to kick up blinding sand. Give a name to Pidgey. Um... Let's name you... I'm gonna name you Stan. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna name you Stan. But two ends, because you're different. Okay, so we got Stan the Pidgey. And let's keep going. Okay, what's next? Let's do a rat tap. It's gonna take three hits, are you serious? Get a crit. Get a crit. Awesome. Okay, keep going. So let's go to the Pokemon Center now. A lot, so I don't use my other potion. Uh, let's talk to these people. It's Pokemon Center in every town ahead. They charge some money, so don't be shy about healing the Pokemon. Pokemon Center is here, you oh, okay, yeah. Make all Pokemon completely healthy, yeah. So if this old guy talks to me about the Pokemon Center, please feel free to use that PC in the corner. Okay, cool. So, so far, I've got nothing. What is this guy saying? Wanna know about the two kinds of caterpillar Pokemon? Nope. Do we even get any money to start? Two dollars. Oh no, wait, I was bringing the Pokedex. So, we'll go to three thousand dollars. I don't even know if they even sell potions yet. I think they do, I think it's Pokeballs now, so... Oh, they sell both! Ooh! Oh, I got a few of these. I got a few of these. And I got a few of these. What do you say? I've got to buy some potions, you never know when your Pokemon will need quick healing. The shop does good business in antidotes, I've heard. Okay. I did just buy some, so they must. What's in this little house? Oh, this is a flash? Or... Okay, to be sure, yeah. They just tell me to read a book, which I'm not. The old guy's up here. Well now, I've had my coffee and that's what I need to get going. Hmm, what is that red box you have? Ah, so you're working on your Pokedex. Well, let me give you a word of advice. Whenever you catch a Pokemon, the Pokedex automatically updates data. 
don't know how to catch a Pokemon, but suppose I suppose I had better show you then. Oh really? Because I didn't just catch a Pokemon or anything. I don't even think I can even speed up through this. Now I wish I could just throw a Pokeball at my level 3 Pidgey. Teachy TV? I don't know what that is. Oh, teach me about the basics? Okay. So, I know I have an item up here. Found another potion, okay, so we're gonna be good on potions for a little while. And over here is actually a new place. We're gonna get here, what can we get here? Ooh, a manky! A manky. Uh I feel like a tackle might kill it. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna keep draining it with Leech Seed. Actually, you know what? Uh, I'll go with the Stan. The Stan's only level 3. Yeah, I put on my defense as well. We can be able to take a tackle from this. Okay, so I should be good from here, and that could have really sucked. Okay, not another tackle. Here we go. Let's see if we can catch me. One, two, three. Got it. Awesome. So we just got Mickey, so that's awesome. I really wish I wrote these things down. So I don't forget. Um, I'll write it down here. So, where am I next? We are making... Fuck off, dude. I hate that my phone does a stupid autocorrect. Level 2 on Route 22. Okay. So what are we going to name our Minky? Um... Let's name him... I mean, we can't put, like... Jackie Chan or Bruce Lee or anything, because that's already for him on Lee and him on Chan. Let's do... I'm just gonna name him Simon. So now we have Simon and we have Stan. I don't believe we can get any other encounters over here. Shit. Okay, great. Great! So both my Pokemon are nearly dead. Dude, shut the hell up. This guy's already at level 9. Okay, that's cool. I can take... I don't think there's even a point of level, uh... What is it? Using a push on my other two Pokemon because they're so low level. Okay. So I they don't lose anyone here because I will literally drop. I just got it. Of 
cool. So your attack missed, now you're dead. Awesome. And I'm at full health. And I'm more likely to go to level 8, I hope. 105, definitely. For level 8, I don't... Uh, Charmander might be level 10. This ain't good. This is not good at all. No, it's level 9. So let's do Leech Seed again. Get some health back. Now I, I want to use Growl, but I can't remember if that lowers defense or attack. So I don't want to waste not getting a hit off, even though I'm missing anyone, so it doesn't really even matter. And I don't think he has Ember yet, but I think he would have used it by now. So, so far, I think I'm good. Growl, so this will tell me. So it lowers attack. Which, I think I should be good if I hit him one more time, and then the Elite Seed will kill him. Okay, cool. Leech Seed kills him, he's done, he's out of my hand. Because I'm not going to lie, I got kind of nervous right there. So, Root Root's up to level 9 now. And halfway to level 10. I heard the Pokemon League is crawling with tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dog dawdling, and that's how you say it, and get a move on. Okay, if you say so. Now, is this a new route? No, this is all one route. Okay. So let's get out of here. Let's go heal up before I do anything else. Uh, Pokemon Center. And I go past the door twice. Okay. That's the gym. Now. I think rock is weak against grass. But I don't want to just go in with that. So we have another route. So let's see if I can get something else to eat. Okay, I'm just going to do one more thing and I'll probably just cut this out. I just want to go see what that first route was. Just so I can mark it down. So I believe it was just Route 1. Okay. So it was Route 1 that we caught Pidgey. Okay, so I'll just kill you real quick. One more hit should do it. Okay, so let's go get one more encounter. So we can go to Route 2. Which I believe we can get someone. Can we get someone up here? Yes, we can. What can we get in here? We get a Raditya. Fudge. No, I mean, Raticate's okay. But, we didn't really want a Raditya. I'm so screwed. If that gets out, I'm definitely kidding. You can go in the middle, you take a plate. Okay. One, two, three. We got rat attack. Route 1, level 2. Route 2. Okay. 
fights anything when attacked. Small and very quick, it is a common sight in many places. Yeah, unfortunately. I'm gonna name you Stuart. Or Stuart Little, for those who know what I'm talking about. But Shit. Okay, cool. So, how do you spell Stuart? S T. U A R T Stuart. I want to look at the box real quick. I believe that's how you spell it, though. Okay, so I was right. So we got Stuart, our rat attack. So I don't think it's... Is there anything else up here? No, there's another one. Okay. So I'm not gonna go any further. Uh, I caught one already? Yes, I have. I just caught one. Are you doing the Viridian Forest? There's a natural maze in there. Be beautiful, we can... Nah, whatever. So, I'm gonna go back down here. I don't think this is. So, I thought Brock Show was Cheater Dream. Yeah, okay. So, that's actually the East. Okay. So, I'm, I'm just being dumb right now. Like, automatically, when I see a gem, I think it's a gem that I have to battle, but that's actually not the case here. That's. The eighth gym, I believe. So let's go through that forest, which will more likely encounter Caterpie or a Weedle. Which I actually hope I encounter a Weedle, because I like Beedro way more than I do Butterfree. I think Beedro's a little bit stronger. We gotta say bad. I came here with some friends to catch some bug Pokemon. We're all itching to get into some Pokemon battles. Well, I'm gonna beat all of them. Uh, the item is not over there. That's somewhere up here. There it is. So my first encounter is a Kakuna. I mean, it is what I want, but I kind of wanted a Weedle, but... I mean, that's one less evolution I get to play with. That's okay. He's hard and that's awesome. That's all you get. Could be worse. I got a meta part and we just harden just like when Ash does when he chase that buff Pokemon trainer. They both have meta pods and all they do is keep using harden. At least it'll be an easy catch. Oh, yep, that could have bad. So, last Pokeball. And we catch him. Awesome. So, Kakuna level 5 and Viridian Forest. What am I gonna name you? You go into a B drill. Um, I don't want to do any more names with S's. I already did three in a row, which I didn't even mean for that to happen. Um, I'm gonna name you. I'm gonna name you. What do I want to name you? Go into a B drill. Let's 
I'm going to name you... What do I want to name you? This is a tough one. What do you name him, Pedro? I'm gonna name you... Uh... Real. Uh... I'm gonna name you... Drillin'. Like, Dylan, but Drillin'. Get it? Cause B Drill. I'm just going with that. I can't. I can't think of anything else off the top of my name. It is only one eye. So I'm gonna name you Drillin. Now we got you. What is this name? Please be a Pokeball. Okay, cool. We got the encounter. Hey, this is the Weedle that I wanted. That's okay. I won't get Brew Root to level 10 and stop using them because that's what I usually do whenever I play a Pokemon game. I usually get my starter to level 10 and I was so close. And then I use the other ones. I don't know, that's just the way I always play this game. Come on, stupid Harden. Making it a lot more difficult for me to kill you. Okay, there we go. You're dead. Root Root's up to level 10, which I believe you get a move. You get Vine Whip. Awesome. I know it's either Vine Whip or Razor Leaf, but that's okay. I don't think there's anything. Okay, here. There's another item. Let's go. I'm gonna put Simon out in front. They got set. I was on Pokeballs to catch Pokemon and I ran out. That's why I can never have too many Pokeballs. True. So I found another potion, which I can actually give out to Kakuna because I have about eight of them. So now you're fully healed. Let's go. There we go. There's a trainer. You probably have like level 5. Level 6. It's not terrible. I mean, I mean, if I get poison, that's pretty bad. Yep, there we go. There's the poison. So, I'm switching you out. Let's go in the stand. Come on, stand. Don't get poison. There you go. String shot, that's annoying. I think it was faster than me anyway. Come on, just don't. Okay, now he's gonna get poisoned. Three, yep, third time's a charm. So here comes. Stewart. Stewart's time to charm. Time to shine, wow. You can have freaking. Okay. I was gonna say, if you got poison, now you're poison. And my attack is. I'm, I'm gonna risk it. Okay, so you're getting the hell out of Oh my god, I clicked no. Okay, so I'm... You really only have Harden. He really does. So that's annoying. I'm doing... I can get him a little XP by putting him in. I'll do that. 
Then I'm just gonna go out to Buru, kill him because I don't have anything else I can really do in this situation. Uh, let's see what Vine does. I'm asking. Honestly, I think Vine would put it in more than Castle. I'll use Castle to kill him. Okay. So now. We gotta heal all them up, which I think I bought enough. I did. So, now, time to use all my potions, or nearly all of them. Yeah, I'll give you one. One more potion for Stuart. Go up here. The crew is only going to have Harden, so I can eventually kill him with Mankey. It's going to take forever and a half. I might even run out of attacks. I don't even know how many I'm getting. Do I get 15 scratches? Oh, no, I get way more. What the hell am I saying? I was using the speed up button, I wasn't even looking. I kind of saw a 1 and it was a 3 instead. Oh, crit! Here we go. Come on. Yeah, you can't go any higher than that. You're done. Level 4. Here we go. Wow, that's... Nice attack. Okay, the other one, you might be able to handle him. There's three Pokemon, so a Weedle. String shot, I can really miss. Why well, does nothing get through like accuracy? Ah, oh, shit. I don't even know what to do, because I, I'm already out of antidotes, I should have bought more. No one I was going in this for, I should have bought more antidotes. I don't know why I only bought more. I didn't want to spend all my money, that's why I didn't. Should have played it more safe than that, though. First episode, I'm already making mistakes. Keep using string shot, I don't care. One more tackle in your own. Don't even poison me. Okay, cool. I'm serious. Now I'm poisoned, right? Nope. Surprisingly not. Level 4 for Stan. Another Weedle. Let's go out to Stewart for this one. I can get at least one attack in. And then I'm gonna let Brute Root finish it. Fine whip. Maybe not. Maybe attack will do a little bit more. Okay, I definitely have one. We go down and out. Stewart's level 4. Why? What? I'm gonna put Stan back out to give him some XP. And then I'm gonna go back out, actually. As a Kuna, he might still only have party, so I'm just gonna stay in. And possibly go to level 5? There's a crit. There we go, level 5 for Stan. 
And learn sand attack. And level 6, okay. I didn't think I was going to get that much. And almost level 7. Well, that's awesome. Oh my god. Um, oh, awesome. That I definitely need. Only one of them is poison. Yeah, I'll use them. Do I want to use them now? I'm trying to think how close I am at the end. Can I go this way? I think I can. I think this is a little Oh, weedle. Come on, Minky! Don't even get poison! Fuck! Man, I was really trying to avoid that. So I'm just gonna have to use... Potion on... Nakey, so he just doesn't die. Okay, so he's level 5. Obviously, you can't go in front. We'll put Kuna in front. I think I just want to get through this quick. I'll put Stan out. The character. I don't even have that many tackles left. Come on, stand. There you go. Stand is job. I need that level 7. Another caterpillar. Go back out. To drawing. Now switch out for a brute root. That would be more more damage than four. Even brute roots get low on health. I don't think I have a choice, I think I might have to move one on him. Okay, so you're dead. That one's level 6. You're almost 11. Okay, so... You need one... the wrong way? Okay, how much health does he have now? I'm using the speed up button, I'm gonna go too fast and he's on that. So two pulses does how much? I'm gonna give him one more potion. 
And I think I'll save him. Don't die on me, you stupid monkey. Thank God. Okay, cool. I finally got back here. I just want to get to that forest. Uh, I'll go buy some more animals. Potions of 300. By five, by four, and then two. Now I get five. No, no, no. I'll, I'll get four, and then I'll get two potions. Hopefully I'm good now. Let's not go in this grass. Try to avoid that. Oh, which way was I supposed to go? Try the middle. No, I went up the middle. If I go this way, isn't this way I went? Can I go this way? And then this way? And then I think I just fought that guy. And I'm just gonna run. Okay, then I go this way, and then up. And I'll fight this guy. Now we got this guy. He has a metapod. So we still can't do anything with no. him. Let's go and just do it. So he might just be used hardened too. Which is actually really annoying. Oh, come on. There we go, so he's finally dead. Stewart's level 5. And then we have Academy. Let's go out to Simon. So I just outsped him. Find him. Okay, so Caterpie's gone. Where's he gonna have left? There's a metapod. I mean, he probably only has parting. He's gonna stay in. It's gonna be a while, but... We'll eventually get through it. Come on, die! The fence won't go up any higher. Now 
One more. Okay. That's done. Simon's level six. Possibly level seven. And you learn low kick, boss. Close to level seven. So now I'm almost out of this stupid forest. I have one more trainer. I don't think there's anything down. Oh, there is an item. So I found a potion! Sweet! I'll face up the last trainer. And get the hell out of here. We have a wheel. Oh, no. Oh, I do this. You're trying to use poison thing and poison me. Okay, so you're not saying it because you... You're not going to last. Say about to stand. Stand's one of my better options for this. Out of the lower level ones. Okay, one more in this time. Okay, cool. So I'm finally gonna be out of this stupid forest. You guys say anything? If you notice the skinny trees on the roadside, they can be cut down by a special move I hear. Many Pokemon live only in the forest and caves. You need to be persistent and look everywhere to get different kinds. You know the evolution cancel technique? When a Pokemon is evolving, you can stop the process. It's a technique for raising Pokemon the way they are. I mean, we'll give them an Everstone, but that works too. We're on Route 2, which we already have our encounter. Now we're in Pewter City. So first off, let's go into this beach. Heal up, and then talk to all of these people. What are you saying? What? Team Rock is on Mount Moon? Huh? I'm on the phone. Scram. Okay. Yo, and when Julie Puff sings, Pokemon get drowsy. Me too. Okay. I really want a Pikachu, so I'm trading my like fairy for one. Well, I don't have one. Hi, glad to meet you. That's unfriendly of you. How about staying in the back? So, come on, tell me about yourself. I'd love to hear about your, hear your profile. Uh, I'm trading Pokemon with that kid there. I had two po two Pikachu, so I figured I might as well trade one. Well, that's kind of mean. Okay, so I think I'm actually gonna end the episode here. So we're at Pewter City now. Um, I want to do a little bit of level grinding before we go into the gym. I want everyone to be at least level 10. I'm pretty sure Brock only has his Onyx and Geodude anyway. So I think Root Root will be fine. I'll probably put him up a few extra levels. But I want everyone else at least at par at level 10. So if you guys enjoyed my first episode, please leave a like, comment, any suggestions you have for me. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video.